This year's theme for our pledge campaign here at St. John's is A Place at the Table. And we chose this theme so that it can be inviting for everyone and anyone who comes to St. John and knows St. John's and participates in any of our programs. Tina and Sarah are going to be here with us in a few minutes to talk to some of our youngest members and see where their place is at St. John's and what they love about St. John's. Hi, Hayden. Hi. So tell me, what do you love about St. John's? Um, well, I like meeting new people and it's very fun to meet I like to be with other people and it's fun to spend time with people you haven't seen in a long time. Yeah. Yeah. And sometimes people will come with you to church. I've had that happen. Like some of my friends have came to church with me here at St. John's Cathedral and it actually kind of feels like home. What do you like about being in church, in worship? Um, I like learning about new things, and I like meeting, meeting some other people. Yeah. Sappho, hey friend. Hi. So, can you tell me a little bit about where you found a place in the St. John's community? Well, it all started a couple of years ago when we and my when me and my mom moved to Colorado. Um from California, which was Whoa. a completely different environment and group of people. Um, but we had um, a pretty great church there, so it was kind of sad to come here. Mm -hmm. And um, at first, we weren't able to, like, find a church that we really liked. When we came here, everyone was just super nice, um, and, like, the community was awesome. So tell me a little bit more about the different communities that you're involved in and things that you've taken part in here at St. John's. Well, the overarching community is great. Like just coming to church and seeing everyone, like you just immediately see people that you're like able to make friends with and like talk to. I'm also in youth group, which is really great. Able to meet a bunch of other like kids my age and we're all super great together and um, it's super fun to hang out with everyone. And like, it just is really nice to like make friends and be able to like just be with people in a setting other than one that you have to go to. Mm, totally, yeah. And um, I'm trying to, you did arts camp, right? Mm -hmm. You were a senior counselor. Mm -hmm. What was that like for you? It was super fun. I was able to help like the little kids um, get on track and help them do the projects and stuff. And um, we have this finished like huge project up in the youth room yes. that looks gorgeous. And it's just, it's fun. You can see everyone's like heart put into it. And it was just great to like be a part of helping make that happen. Thank you so much. We're so glad you're here mm -hmm. at St. John's. Mm -hmm. It's the best. It's great here. Hi, Penelope. Hi. So tell me, what do you love about St. John's? Um, I really like that it's a really welcoming community and that it's not just church and there's a lot of other opportunities like choir and youth group and confirmation classes. Mm -hmm. What other things have you done here at St. John's? I've done youth group. I've been in choir since I was eight or nine. Um, youth group, godly play. Um, I've done cathedral camp, which is the diocese. And we also get to do other things, like we got to write letters to Michael Bennett about the farm bill. We get to do lots of really fun things. Where do you feel you have a place here at St. John's? I think, I mean, I really, um, choir, I think, because it's an opportunity for me to be part of the service and not just watching. And I get to sing and, um, I've read on Christmas Eve, like the Christmas stories before. And I also like that because I get to be part of it um, and not just watching it. Hi, Eva. Hi. So tell me, what do you love about St. John's? Um, the people and everybody is so nice and helpful. So tell me more about the people at St. John's. What do you like about them? Um, they're also friendly and they always are happy to see me. Well, we sure love having you here. You're an important part of this community. 
I love being here. Hey, Jack. Hi. Thanks for being here. Of course. So great to see you. It's good to see you too. Um, so tell me a little bit. I'm curious about where you found a place here in the St. John's community. Well, um, I've always had a place in the St. John's community. Um, I grew up here. I was baptized here. Uh, I've been going to St. John's since I was about a year old. And the community has always been very welcoming, very friendly, and um, very large. And I see you're wearing a Cathedral Ridge hat. Can you tell me more about what you've done at Cathedral Ridge? Uh, yeah, I've been going to Cathedral Ridge for a very long time, um, since I was maybe six years old. Wow. Uh, recently, I kind of aged out of camp, and I decided to start working there. No way! Yeah. What are you doing? Uh, a lot of dishwashing, <laughs> <laughs> uh, but also just maintenance thing and things and housekeeping things. Uh, I do get to be a camper one week um, during high school camp, and that is also really fun. Nice. That's so cool to be able to give back to something that you've been a part of for a long time. It is. Yay. So tell me a little bit more about um, your community here. Um, so I'm very involved in youth group. That is my all-time favorite thing to do. Um, there are quite a few kids my age. I've been going to youth group since I was um, in sixth grade, and I've gotten to grow up with all these wonderful people and watch them and myself grow and change. Well, thank you so much for being here at St. John's, being here today. You are amazing, and we're so grateful that you're a part of our community because you're just fantastic. And I'm just... I'm just so grateful that we get you for two more years. <laughs> and then who knows what will happen. Yeah. But you'll always have a home here at St. John's. Well, thank you. I always feel at home here in St. John's. Yay.